Hi hey everyone, I have three very exciting unboxings today, three vintage coach items. I took them out of their shipping boxes, but I haven't opened up the bags that they came in. So I'll start with the first one. This may be the one I'm most excited about. This is actually a coach key fob charm. Um, I got this on Poshmark, and one of the reasons I got it was I absolutely loved the color. So, um, I I love the idea of bag charms. I don't have any luxury bag charms, except I do have, I have a coach charm. That's not true. It's, I think it was really a, um, a keychain, though. And, ooh, let's see what this is. This is the hang tag. Let me see. This is interesting. Let's see what this says. Um, oh, okay, I guess this is the um, the little teeny weeny little coach hang tag. Can you see that? Oh my gosh. So, so cute. Um, and this came from the cat's meow. That's uh, that's the person on on um, Poshmark who sold this, and I think they actually have um, a lot of coach, a lot of coach bags. But anyway, here we go. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Look at that! Look how adorably cute that is! Oh my god! I love this. Oh, I love little miniature things. Doesn't matter what it is. I just love little miniatures. So this would attach to your coach bag. And I have my little um, mini chase here. It's probably a little maybe big for that, but just to, to give an idea of how it would how it would attach, I could actually just hook it right on this and then just do that or I could put it on this um, little loop here which I may do on one of my bigger bags but oh my god how cute is that oh my gosh this is in the color leaf and it is everything that I thought it would be and then more oh my gosh oh my gosh how cute and then I'm gonna I have to put this um, little hang tag on it I will do. I think they probably took it off just to keep it safe and make sure maybe it wouldn't um, put an impression in the leather, but that is just super cute. Yeah, I'm gonna put it on there later. Oh my gosh. So that is number one, most amazing little uh, key fob charm. I love it. Okay, now. The next items are bags. Let me just get that out of the way. Okay. And, and it came in this nice little pouch, which was which was nice. Okay. Now, this is a British tan bag. It is a carnival bag. It is vintage. I had a British tan coach bag once upon a time. I gave it away. I could kill myself, kick myself over that. Um, so I was on a quest for something vintage coach, British tan, and that beautiful glove tan leather. And I bought two bags on eBay. And I have not seen them in person yet. So let's see. You're gonna you're gonna see with me. Oh, okay. Very nice. This is the carnival bag. And obviously, because it's vintage, you know, it's not in brand new condition, but I do plan on giving this a shampoo and conditioning it myself. Part of the fun of doing this was um, I wanted to be able to condition, um, wash it and condition it myself. So I bought um, everything I need to do that. And I'm gonna actually do that while the weather's still nice so I can let it sit outside in the sun um, to dry. 
but here's the bag, the inside of the bag. It's just um, one big compartment. There's, there's nothing, um, you know, no pockets inside. There's just this pocket in the front. And this must be the strap. Yep, here we go. Here's the leather strap. This appears to be in excellent condition. Um, it's always nice when you buy something and it's in better condition than you anticipated. Um, I would say no surprises here. This looks pretty good. Let's see. There we go. Shoulder strap or crossbody. And very, very nice. Now, hmm, mm hmm. Um, I don't see. Ah, here's the Creed. The Creed is in that, that front pocket, which. I don't know. That's interesting. Um, I uh, I have my my coach expert uh, contact. I'm I'm gonna ask her. I didn't. I don't know if that. Well, maybe. I guess where else would you put it? Unless they had put a label inside. But um, uh, she looked at this for me online before I bought it and said it looked authentic to her. So um, hopefully it is. What I think it is. From the sheer number of people who were watching this um, to buy it, I, I feel like, you know, people who were much more knowledgeable than I am um, recognized that it was authentic. So anyway, this is adorable and I'm very excited and very pleased with this purchase and um, I will, wait, I put this in the wrong place. I'm going to clean this up even though it looks pretty good and I am going to use it. So that's bag number or coach item number two and now the final coach item here is this Stewart bag this was an auction on eBay and I did win the auction uh, which was exciting and they sent this came from Canada um, so it took a little while to get here and they sent me this such a lovely note which is just a nice touch um, I sell things on eBay and I always put a brief little note in, but it's always nice to see when someone does that and they take that extra step. So anyway, um, I will cut this open. And this bag actually looked like it was gonna need a bath from the pictures, but through this plastic, it's looking pretty good, I have to say. It'd be better than, than I would have thought. So let me see. So, this is a large bag, actually a very large bag. Oh my gosh, and look at that, look. Oh my gosh, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. That super soft glove tan leather. Wow, it's got, uh, it's got the four feet. It's got the, uh, the turn lock in the front. And let's see. Um, oh my gosh, they've got, oh, it's got the, uh, the hang tag there, the coach tag, and the, oh, the buckles look really nice. Oh my gosh, and look, they put all this packaging in to keep it, oh, oh, and that's, okay, that's got the, um, the, uh, hand, or the strap in it. So here you can see the inside, just one big, one big pocket, and, oh no, wait, wait, wait. Oh no, yeah, it's one big pocket. The Creed, the Creed is in there as well. I don't know if you can see, but the Creed is right there. Um, this does not have a back pocket, but it has two pockets, two slip pockets in the front under the flap, which is nice to keep your things secured. And of course, this was made in the days before cell phones when you needed quick access, but that's okay. <laughs> um, this is, you know, this is part of the beauty of vintage that things, you get things the way that they were and the way that they were intended for people when they were made. And um, it's kind of part of the charm of that. Oh my gosh, this bag is actually in great condition as well. And I am still gonna give it a bath and I am going to, um, I am going to clean it up, but just more for my peace of mind because it actually looks really good. And here is the strap, there. And I'm gonna attach the strap on both sides. Wow. 
Oh, this is just so nice. The, the buckle is just so solid. Just, you can tell how well made this is or was. Oh, wow. You know, I wish that I had been a huge coach fan back in the day because I would have probably bought a bunch of coach um, and I just wasn't into it. And, and like I said, I had this beautiful British tan coach it was a briefcase tote bag kind of a bag. I don't even remember what the model was, but um, I gave it away, which was so sad. But anyway, here's my bag. Um, and this is the stewardess, vintage stewardess in British tan. So there you have it, stewardess in British tan, carnival bag in British tan, and the vintage key fob in leaf. Thank you for watching and um, going down the vintage coach journey with me. Um, I'm really excited and once I wash them and condition them, I'll make another video and I'll show um, what they look like. Thank you, bye.